Please welcome the next competitor. Veuillez accueillir le prochain patineur. Representing Japan, Takahito Mora. So next up out onto the ice, the reigning Japanese bronze medalist, Takahito Mora. You saw him there getting some final bits of support from his father, who is also his coach. Takahito made it back onto the national podium last season after a three-year absence from the top. Okay. Now trying to break into the top echelon of today's men's competitors. Well, Janet, there's just such a logjam of talent in the men's event in Japan. and stay on his feet, which has been the name of the game so far in the short program. And there's that big triple axle we talked about during the warm up. It's a good thing he landed it because it was right on the music. <laughs> on the musicality of those jumping passes, but I've seen an overall growth in his components in recent seasons. Overall, just jumps aside, his attention to detail and the music that he's skating to is vastly improved. He doesn't look completely satisfied with that performance, probably wanting that quad toe back, but otherwise a pretty solid performance in this men's event today. And you talked about the performance, John, and for me this is a little bit of personal life meets work life, but I've been able to spend quite a bit of time with Takahito over the last year or so because both his choreographers, Massimo Scali for the short program and my husband Charlie White for his free skate work out of my home rink. And I have to say, to your point, he is so much more focused and disciplined in the way he's approaching his training this season from what I saw in practice. And you really have no other option, not only in the world, but in Japan. It has to be a 110% commitment. So it's no wonder he's wincing because he stepped out of a quad jump, because at home, at a national championships, that may be what it takes to land him off the podium. And he's been used to training and competing against Names like Takahashi, Oda, Kazuka, Yuzuru. 81.24. Nonetheless, that is a very strong score for the short program. Well behind Patrick Chan, but still in second place. And Patrick Chan, who I just mentioned, still with the lead with just over 90 points.